everyone can agree that Legos are loved by all, but the price of Legos though, well, not so much. So here are some of the best Lego knockoffs that you can go out and get if you're on a budget. And let's start things off with the Mold King. Fans of Lego will be familiar with the Mold King, the Chinese analog. And let's just say that in the field of brick-based creations, Mold King distinguishes out for its expertise in making copies of remote-controlled vehicles and works really well as a Lego knockoff. I mean, these complex vehicles can be operated remotely using either a standard remote control or even even a smartphone. Mold King also has some great products too, but their off-road buggy surely stands out. Overall, it's not a bad knockoff, but nothing's gonna beat the King Lego. But what about this next knockoff, which is something that everybody loves, Minions, right? Well, this is the Minion Munchies Mayhem. I mean, from a first glance looking at these guys, you wouldn't even really assume they're Lego, but nonetheless, with this set, you get to experience the crazy shenanigans of these yellow companions as they open up a hot dog stand. However, these hot dogs do seem very different from the regular Lego hot dogs because of their unusually flat profile. I mean, take a look at this and then take a look at this. Big difference, right? But for what's next, let's talk about something more unique, which is laser pegs. If you're looking for something different from the standard Lego brick building experience of just, you know, like this yellow block and this blue block, then you might want to check out these laser pegs. In order to create its unique reflecting beauty, laser pegs does take an unusual approach by using transparent bricks and illuminated power bricks. Basically, your first impressions of this thing would be that, oh, it's Legos that glow in the dark. Now, of course, this aesthetic may not be for everyone, but but it's quite popular with some builders in the millennial generation. On top of that though, you gotta admit, it is pretty cool because the see-through blocks can be used to give, you know, lame, boring areas of like your room or something to give them a nice new shine, something unique to look at, so you can't beat it there. But can you beat Lele? All right, let me explain. Lele is a Chinese Lego knockoff, which sometimes gets confused with Bella, which began by producing Lego knockoff minifigures before expanding into larger sets like the Star Wars Ultimate Collector series R2-D2. The many series that are available on Lele range from Star Wars to Jurassic World, Ninja, Heroes, Gatherings, Superheroes, My World, Worldcraft, Nexo Soldiers, Friends, and Creators, The Simpsons, Castle, Ultra Agent City, SpongeBob, Lord of the Rings, Pokemon, Dragon Ball Z, Big Hero 6, and so much more. I mean, look, we've all wanted to have a Dragon Ball Z Lego minifigure, but Lego never made them. Well, guess what? Now you can get one. Check this one out. Now it's time for number 10 on the list, which is Slewban. When it comes to the field of sets with military-related themes, Lego has always opted to take a more traditional approach and keep its distance from the market. Basically, what I'm trying to say is LEGO doesn't really like making military sets. They're kind of more kid-friendly, if you know what I mean, but I'm not saying that there isn't military sets out there. On the other hand, though, by LEGO taking such an approach, it has unintentionally created a gap in the market that allowed smaller businesses like Slewban to fill it in with their unique military sets. Now, don't be so quick, though, to describe Slewban as one of those one-trick pony companies just because it's displaying military skills with a banner that's being waved high and proud. No, no, no. They, they do so much more. Because this company has a creative collection that goes well beyond the barracks, going into the fascinating world of real-life jobs and cars, similar to that of the original LEGO. Think of Slewban as covering more than just the tanks and troops. This right here, though, is Mega Blocks. It's one of the most oversized knockoffs of LEGO, and Mega Blocks is an extension of Mega Constructs, which is a heavyweight rival in the world of kid-friendly building experiences. Think of it as the hip, cool sibling of Duplo, made especially for the tiniest of hands. Because these bricks are an ideal companion for the the younger builders out there as they are larger and easier to grip, much like the superheroes of safety. It's definitely an opportunity for younger kids to soar in an environment that is both secure and easy, and it's a lot similar like Legos. Together though, Duplo and Mega Blocks dance like they're ready to take on the world, but we can't pretend otherwise because size matters. <laughs> you, you know what I mean? This right here is Banbao, and Banbao is a name that can grab your interest given that it is an active participant when it comes to the creative construction and a challenger in a fascinating world of Lego knockoffs. If you take a look at how Banbao manufactures its products, you'll see that it uses a special trick. They actually share a playing field with LEGO and can hold their own when it comes to particle size while still getting along with them. But here's the bigger catch though, their plates and pellets are stronger than the typical LEGO piece. And again though, don't let that deceive you because these blocks still share fondness for adaptability and can be created together without any noticeable gaps. So what's the deciding factor? Well, it's unparalleled when it comes to quality. And of course, since there is no serious competition, Banbao is free to set their prices at will. So compared to Lego, it's, it's pretty good. But is it as good as Mega Constructs? Mega Constructs Wonder Builders is a great knockoff of Lego, and it brings together low cost and imaginative play that is an impressive display of creation. You can choose to enjoy a carefully prepared set or the excitement of creating your own unique set. In terms of variety too, licensed sets do stand out as a thriving market that does welcome fans of all ages. I mean, this knockoff does have sets revolving around Halo and Game of Thrones and many other cool things too. 
And speaking of which, quite recently, Mega Contracts Wonder Builders has found tremendous success in the licensed magic market, but the company's original items now may be harder to come by because of it. But this in no way lessens the appeal of the opportunities that exist with the knockoff. For one, fans of the game Halo can now build classic vehicles and structures from the game by putting together sets such as the Covenant Armory Packs, the UNSE Warthog Run, and many more sending shockwaves throughout the gaming universe. Or hold on a second, because now Game of Thrones fans can have something to celebrate too, thanks to the Winterfell Defense Construction Set. This masterwork gives you the opportunity to construct your very own Winterfell and recreate great moments from the series complete with character figures too. I mean, who can forget their own little minifigs? Additionally, the Legends Motorbike Raid Building Set is the height of a challenge for those who have owned their skills in the trenches of Call of Duty. So go out and find your favorite set. But will you find one with brain flakes? Not so long ago, a newcomer to the scene by the name of Via Heart debuted in the crowded world of of building wonders in 2010 with a hidden gem called Brain Flakes, one of their best LEGO alternatives, which is a secret treasure that has not yet graced the radar of everyone. It's definitely a newer company around the block, but now that we have that out of the way, let's talk about the magic that Brain Flakes brings to the table. On top of that too, these precious objects are completely risk-free for children and can work their magic on children as young as three years old, so they're very safe, making it possible for the whole family to go on a creative journey together. Then again though, the versatility versatility of brain flakes is one of the things that makes them so appealing as a lego knockoff why not try it out i mean it is pretty good for a lego knockoff now it's time to talk about magna tiles i mean this is another great lego knockoff and there's a reason why they're recognized and acclaimed as a brand that is allowed for use in stem fields because they harness the power of 3d magnet tiles which of course can become the very building blocks of creative expression and yes it does stand out in a very unique way because these tiles connect to one another in a very different way because i mean they're magnet Magnets. And when it comes to size and complexity, there is a clear differentiation that can be made. Because it's possible that magnet tiles, which are larger and more detailed than regular Lego pieces, will push their price per piece a little bit higher than usual. But don't let that fool you though, because they are very different and kind of worth the price. A short one, I know, but now let's just move on to Creo. And I feel like you've heard about this one. Because Creo has established itself as a strong Lego rival for years and years already. I mean, this particular manufacturer offers a one of a kind combination of licensed products and original constructions with a better preference than lego on the other hand though if you're just looking for something that's unexplored and completely something new to try out creo is a good option but even while creo did dabble in original sets at one point in time it appears that they have since moved on to other things and you know firmly planted elsewhere it's a common thing with all these lego knockoffs i mean they just stick to something like another franchise like halo game of thrones star wars i mean it just works out better because i mean the sets are just cooler i mean i can't lie in general though the works that creo has produced are illustrative examples of quality which has earned the company appreciation from the community i mean a lot of lego fans know about it but what's the secret ingredient exactly well it's been passed down in the family for generations because creo's ability to produce ideas of the highest quality is not just a lucky coincidence but rather an inheritance given to the company by its parent company hasbro oh yeah everybody knows hasbro it's one of the biggest global giants when it comes to toy manufacturing to begin with the star trek series is one of the most popular options out there i mean these sets inspired by the 2009 reboot and its sequel Star Trek Into the Darkness let fans recreate their favorite moments from the films including their favorite ships and characters from the Star Trek world. A lot of the newer people out there and maybe a lot of people watching this video won't even know what Star Trek is but back then it was huge. And no Creo isn't stopping there because they've also joined the action with the G.I. Joe universe. Sets based on the live action films, the adventure team, a real American hero allow fans to create their own situations in the G.I. Joe universe that are true to the show's essence. And their creativity still doesn't end there though because their adaptability is demonstrated by the success of the cityville invasion series of their products i mean these sets are modeled after a hit online game cityville and provide kids the tools to create their own thriving metropolises from the ground up encouraging a special kind of blend of construction and creativity i mean it's clear to say that creo is one of the more popular knockoffs i mean it's probably top three but is it as good as ruminate look everyone no matter what their gender is does take pleasure in playing with legos or buildings legos i mean it's just an undeniable fact on the other hand, though, one cannot help but note that the landscape of building sets typically trends towards catering most to male consumers. Basically, what I'm trying to say is like Legos and stuff, typically you associate it with the boys, right? But this gap may cause some girls to dismiss a field that has the potential to stoke their fires of creativity within them and refine their ability to find solutions to complex problems. But behold the solution, because Room to Me... <laughs> How do you say this, bro? Yup, Roomnate is a brand that is on a mission to bridge this gap, recognizing 
recognizing the hidden potential that girls possess and waiting to be awakened within them. But despite having admirable objectives, Room- Bro, I'm gonna hate- Oh my god. The Ruminate is currently in the process of expanding its business. There are sets which are like puzzles waiting to be solved might occasionally be a little bit challenging to put together properly. But let's not sugarcoat the reality here because when it comes to the routine of locking pieces together, there is a trace of dissatisfaction that periodically emerges with this uh, knockoff, which is just evidence of the never-ending process of improvement and just how much better LEGO really is, like the real official company. But does number two have that exact same thing in mind? And that's Cata Bricks. The Car Technic series is representative of the company's enormous breadth of product offerings, yet that merely scratches the surface of Cata's vast body of accomplishments as a LEGO knockoff. I mean, their portfolio features amazing concepts and creations in a variety of product categories, including engineering, the military, and firearms, amongst others. And to begin with, the efficacy of Cata cannot be called into question, because yet, there are some users who do feel like the product may benefit from certain enhancements to its usability. For example, it would be much more useful if the bags were properly labeled and the instructions could be arranged in such a way that the components could be located rapidly and quickly and, you know, just make it really quicker to build and m much easier. You know, after messing up with a variety of various sets that are comparable to LEGO, even we are able to claim with absolute certainty that the fit of Cata bricks is very similar to that of LEGO's, if not identical. On top of that, Cata's quality is the primary factor that draws other people into it. I mean, their performance in the market in comparison to that of rival alternatives and other knockoffs is just amazing. I mean, it's like comparing Apple to Android. I mean, come on, we all love Apple here. I mean, comment Apple if you love Apple. When compared to real Lego bricks, though, their genuine value becomes evident, as the value they bring more justifies the cost. Of course, they aren't the most reasonably priced stars in the sky, but the value you get from them do justify the cost. I mean, it's just really good for a Lego knockoff. But now, let's top it off with the number one spot, and that's Kobe. Kobe is a unique competitor in the market for building blocks, as it creates designs that effortlessly carve out their own space among the Lego dynasty and its many rivals. Kobe's designs have an unmistakable unmistakable smooth appearance, which they achieve by making careful use of larger plastic parts for the exterior of each structure. This is a one-of-a-kind approach that provides a specific style to their constructions, which separates them from others in an environment in which diversity does play an important role. Still though, this visual innovation does come with a trade-off in the form of a limitation on the artist's ability to reuse these components from one set to another. You're kind of limited when it comes to that. Then again, Kobe's singular concentration on real-world transportation in particular automobiles and airplanes, is one of the most notable characteristics that set the company apart from its competitors. On the one hand, it positions their sets as an artful display piece, similar to the worksmanship of model planes and vehicles that fans can passionately appreciate, and on the other hand, it positions their sets as an artful display pieces, similar to the attention of detail of modern trains. And as a result, this addition of originality and realism raises the aesthetic appeal, which does attract the attention of people who are looking for intriguing show pieces to decorate their houses and shelves. It's just a more aesthetic approach to Lego, and it's really cool pieces for your room and things around the house. It's just a cool decorative piece. And now for the most exciting bonus revelant Lego knockoff part, Unico, an Italian construction toy manufacturer that provides a unique choice for the youngest builders just starting out on their imaginative journeys, and it does stand out as one of the greatest Lego knockoffs on the market. Although the pieces of Unico are a different color scheme than those of Lego Duplo, they are designed to be fully compatible with the original Lego Duplo system. For kids older than two years old, the Unico Farm stands out as the best option among Unico's options. The Unico Farm is an extensive collection of 126 pieces that make for a fun and instructive construction experience for young minds. The bright pieces of the set also have been carefully crafted to the interests of children and to teach them about animals and their environments. All in all, the Unico Farm is also a great alternative for children of all ages since it does get them to start off with their first building experience with age-appropriate tools. Anyways, now you know the full list of fun Lego knockoff, and I want to know which ones are on your radar so why not drop a comment down below let me know because i really do want to know which ones you think are the best oh and don't forget to subscribe subscribe we're the best